we're looking at today is a little Raven Arms 25. These were an inexpensive gun. You used to could buy them for $49 in the tax. And uh, I think they've been out of production for quite a number of years. I bought this one probably in the mid to late 90s. And somebody would say, well, you got better guns. Why would you keep that one around? The simple truth of the matter is, is if I tried to sell this gun, I wouldn't get hardly anything out of it. And me having a small pocket gun, even though it's a 25 ACP, sometimes that's the biggest thing you can carry. I know there are 32s that are lighter and just as small. I know there's 380s that are just as small. That's all well and good. You know, I may or may not have some of those. This gun here, it's been around a while. Um, like I said I bought it new for 49 bucks. One of the things I like about this gun is having a gun at times beats having nothing. This beats a hell of a lot. Uh, this beats my pocket knife all to pieces. And it beats throwing a rock at somebody. Now this gun, the two mags, and the inside the waistband holster all fit in this little tobacco pouch. So it's very convenient. I can throw this whole setup in my back pocket and nobody know what it is. Is it quick to get out of that tobacco pouch? No, not really. But it would be a deep cover gun. It would be something I would throw in a suitcase when I was traveling in a non-permissive environment. Uh, and a low threat environment. If it was non-permissive and a higher threat, we would make arrangements to have some bigger hardware coming along. It is what it is. I haven't had any problems with this gun. I shoot it about once a year or so. I just shot it this morning. Still functions fine. Shot well. It's going to get cleaned up. Reloaded, put back in the bag, and put back in the safe. Uh, carry six and one, six rounds in the mag, one in the chamber. Just a basic little gun. You know, there's going to be people that are going to knock it, but the truth of the matter is, you know, I can put this in my pocket and have it with me. And the days where your 9mm or 45 may get a little too big or a little too heavy or whatever. You know, to be armed is better than to not be armed. Uh, that's about all I have to say about that. Later on.